And of course, the test craft we shot out of the cannon fell without ever reaching the moon. So after we retrieved it, we debated over what we should do next. That was a lot of fun. Then the old man told me something out of the blue. He said that his life wasn't too exciting, but I guess it hasn't been too bad since I met you, and stuff like that. I got a little embarrassed and said, Stop talking like your life's coming to an end or something. Maybe. Maybe he was feeling some sort of premonition about it. So, that's pretty much why I'm trying to go to the moon. Really? I'm glad you think so. Usually when I tell people I want to go to the moon, they look at me all funny. Yep, he is. He was killed in the war. I don't know why this war started. I don't really care at this point. Even though the vampires had the upper hand in battle at the beginning, the table suddenly turned one day. It was the government's poison gas weapon that did it. It didn't matter who you were. Once that thing got to you, you just died. Our village was pretty much completely wiped out, except for a handful of people and me, as I was far away at the time. That's when the old man died too. Goodbye has come so suddenly. Oh no, no, I'm sorry too. I didn't mean to tell you such a depressing story. 